Jordan, welcome to Barnet Football Club. I'm sure you're delighted to get your deal over the line. Yeah, I'm sort of over the moon. It was um, I had a great chat yesterday with the gaffer and Dean, and it sort of it really like cemented the idea in my head that I want to come here and I want to sort of take the next step of my career um, here. And it's such a huge club. And when I saw that sort of the league that Barnet are in, I thought that's a massive club. They should be back in the football league. It sort of really attracted me. And then knowing that the gaffer. Um, uh, had uh, had been appointed here. I thought, no, nah, this is this is a great club to be at and a great opportunity for me. I think so. Yeah, no, I'm really delighted. So, you join us from Norwich. Um, tell us a little bit about your time there. Yeah, no, it was good. I was there for uh, four years, I think, and um, I've learned so much and developed so much as a player and a person. Um, and I sort of had a um, fairly decent season um, a couple of seasons ago with getting with the first team and getting that experience in the Premier League and seeing what it's really about at the top level and I think that's what's made me hungry today and made me want to come down here and um, sort of come back to London and um, sort of play and get my chance to sort of, sort of show what I can really do and fulfil my potential um, and yeah no, so it was, it was a great great experience for me being being at Norwich and I think I've learned a lot which I can now take um, take on to here and hopefully start playing here and helping the team. So for the fans that won't have seen you in action what sort of player can they expect from you? Um, well I'm sort of I'm very athletic uh, I like to get up and down the pitch um, I'm a defender first and foremost so that's what I, I like to pride myself on um, but then I also like to get forward and, and help the attackers and try and get as many assists as possible and um, yeah feed the attackers. And what's your ambition for this season for you as a player personally and also for Barnet Football Club and the team? Um, personally, um, I just want to get as many games as possible and sort of develop and see how I can um, handle myself in this in this very good league. Um, as a club, as I mentioned before, um, it's a huge club. It shouldn't be in the National League. Um, I think it should be, be, be in the Football League and my whatever part I play whether that's playing or sort of just training and trying to get myself in the team I just want to help get this club back to where it really belongs in the football league and, and as high as possible and hopefully be on that journey. So when I saw you out in the corridor before um, you bumped into Mason Bloomfield who I just interviewed as well and yeah. you, you knew each other yeah. so I suppose from your perspective it's good to A already know someone who's here yeah. um, but B you know playing with that calibre of player going into the next campaign? Yeah, definitely. Yeah, no, to, Me and Mason was together at Norwich and um, I think it's good, especially in my position as a fullback and him being a striker, um, we can sort of, we can work with each other and having that good relationship anyway, I think that that's really important um, out there on the pitch and it, it can really show, it can really show in games. Um, so yeah, no, it's really good to see him and to, to see that, yeah, that level of player in the building it shows what the gaffer and Dean and uh, the club want to do. Um, going forward and yeah it's really exciting times and just lastly fans back in the stadium all being well next season <laughs> bet you can't wait to get in front of uh, the B army and hear them cheering for you yeah yeah I'm really looking forward to that it's been sort of a long time coming for everyone they all over the world in 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 in, in every way um, but yeah no it'll be, it'll be really good to get back um, to get in front of these fans and to meet the fans um, but I've heard some good things so yeah no I'm, I'm really looking forward to it